Welcome to the Open Lab, one of the most advanced acoustic research centers in the world owned by a private company. It represents a form of industrial archaeology since we completely converted this whole place, which used to be one of Kaini's first production sites back in the 50s. From here, we have full control of the tests performed in the other rooms. Just to give you an idea, we had to employ more than 40 kilometers of electrical and data cables in order to connect the whole building. And this is our RevLab, the reverberation room. The acoustic conditions inside this place resemble one of a huge cathedral. Just to give you an idea, this is the level of reverberation we can generate inside this room. I will be clapping and trying to communicate, but I'm not sure what you're going to understand. What do we do inside this environment? We conduct tests on the sound absorbing potential of different materials by comparing reverberation time before and after the installation of sound absorbing materials. That orange door is one of the unique features of the Open Lab since we can connect this place with the Supernova Lab. This is the Supernova Lab, our semi-anechoic chamber. Conceptually, the absolute opposite when compared to the previous room, the Rev Lab. The level of silence we reach in here allows us to record even the most imperceptible noises. But what do we do in here? For example, we collaborate with our new colleague, Mike. In reality, he's a binaural head, a sophisticated microphone capable of listening to sound just like humans. And this is exactly what we do here at the Open Lab. We study sound, but also its effects on human beings, hence improving our psychophysical well-being, and not just mics.